Hey guys, welcome back to another tech tip and in today's video we're going to do something pretty simple and pretty quick and that is change your lock screen photo with Windows 10. Check it out. Like I was saying, in today's video it's going to be a very straightforward process, very simple, very quick to do. All you're going to want to do is just find an empty space on your desktop, right click it, come on down, left click on personalize, and then on the left hand setting, once it brings up that menu, you're going to want to click on lock screen. From here, it's going to give you a lock screen information and you can see we've got a preview of the, what the background will look like and then we've got some other information we'll go over real quick. So I've got this dark or this nighttime mountain range scene as I said as my current lock screen. You can go through and you can choose the window spotlight which will have windows choose like an array of photos. They can go through and cycle through your lock screen or if you want to choose a single picture you can click on picture and that'll allow you to choose from a certain gallery or if you want to add a folder you can actually do a slideshow of your own and actually have a few different photos uh, cycle through and rotate across the screen as well so quick uh, quick tutorial on the pictures you click on picture click on browse and then you're going to want to navigate to the folder that you have the picture in I've downloaded three of these photos just for this demonstration purpose. So as you can see right now I've got the dark mountain range or the nighttime mountain range set as the current lock screen. So let's go ahead and change that by clicking browse. And let's do the lake mountain screen which is the same one as our, as our wallpaper. And then once you've left click on it you can click on choose picture. And you can see that the preview has changed and we're going to lock the computer to show you what it looks like. So if we lock it you can see that the mountain range has changed to the daytime with the lake in it. So we're going to click sign in. And let's choose one more. Let's click browse. Let's do this gardeny one with the waterfall. So we'll left click on that. You can see the preview again has changed. Go and lock the screen again. And you can see again that the lock screen has actually changed. So it's just one more way to make your computer reorder, to make it personalized. Uh, another thing that you can do is you can choose the slideshow. And you can see that the pictures is the default folder under the slideshow album. What you can do is you can click add a folder. That's going to bring up a Windows Explorer window where you can navigate and find a different folder if you have a specific like maybe you had like a family gathering or something you want to show off those pictures as your lock screen. You can navigate to that folder, click on it, click choose this folder and you can see that it saves that folder and it will continue cycling through those images in a rotation. I believe it's like a minute, 30 seconds to 45 seconds before it will slide to the next one. Some other cool features for your lock screen if we go further down on the menu is you've got get fun facts, tips and more from Windows Cortana so you can turn that on or off. And if you have it off then it feels less cluttered. If you have it on you'll get some tips and tricks, just kind of some text around the lock screen. And then of course if you have like calendar set up and you've got your mail set up, you can actually enable those apps to show at a glance information on the lock screen as well. Hey everyone, thanks for watching that tech tip. If you liked the video, if you found the video useful, give it a thumbs up, leave any kind of comment or feedback in the comment section below the video. And of course, while you're down there, don't forget to hit the subscribe and we will see you next time.